Mallory Adams of the Lake County Examiner. It's Friday, April 20th, 2018. Here's your two-minute video news source for everything Oregon Outback. It's The Flash. A pair of candidate forums took place this week, one at North Lake High School on Tuesday, April 17th, while the AAUW Lakeview Forum took place on Wednesday, April 18th. The six candidates running for county commissioner gave opening statements and then addressed questions from the audience during both events. At the first forum, questions ranged from better communication between both ends of the county, ordinance enforcement, the education system, and the possibility of more commissioner presence on the north end. During the Lakeview event, five of the seven candidates who are contending for the Democratic nomination for Congressional District 2 were present, answering questions from the audience about Dreamers, medical marijuana, and firearms. Local candidates were also given time to field questions about law enforcement, climate change, animal control, and more. Lake Arts Council will present its final concert of its season tonight, Friday, April 20th, with Tom Rigney and Flambeau at the First Presbyterian Church, starting at 6.30 p.m. Arriving to Lakeview from San Francisco, Rigney comes with 35 years of violin musicianship, along with four-piece backing band Flambeau. The group will present its unique blend of Cajun influence that has been on display for the past 20 years. Tickets will be available at the door for $15 for individuals, $25 for a couple, and $35 for families. A new support group for diabetics was formed this week through Lake District Hospital. Led by Janine Sims, the first get-together was held on Monday, April 16th, welcoming guest speaker Tara Gill, registered dietitian with the hospital, who spoke about the types of diabetes and the basics of healthy eating and managing the chronic condition. The next meeting will be held on Monday, April 30th at 6.30 p.m. at the First Presbyterian Church. Tim Tucker is heading to familiar territory. The former co-owner of Subway after 13 years is heading back to real estate, landing a job as a realtor with Fable Utley. Before owning Subway, he was a realtor at Action Realty in Lakeview for 10 years. Tucker got out of the business to try something new when he settled on becoming a Subway franchisee. Tucker returned to Fable Utley about a month ago, then went on vacation for a few weeks before returning at the beginning of the month. Well. There's the buzzer, so that does it for us this week. Be sure to check out our online calendar to keep up with everything happening around Lake County. Follow us across these social media sites. Catch a new Lake County Flash every Friday, a hot spot every Tuesday, and for these stories and so much more, be sure to pick up the next Lake County Examiner. Lake County School District number 7 is officially gearing up for our 2018-19 school year with our annual kindergarten roundup. This pre-registration and screening event allows parents and teachers to simplify the process of enrolling upcoming kindergarten students as well as an opportunity to discuss questions, determine school placement, and receive useful summer activities for each of your students. There are two roundup events taking place, one at Union Elementary on Tuesday, May 1st at 5.30 p.m and the other at Fremont Elementary on Thursday, May 3rd at either 5 to 6 p.m. or 6 to 7 p.m. Eligible children must be five years old on or before September 1st, 2018 to enroll. We hope to see you there.